It is something on the minds of many parents in the summer months, keeping kids safe around the water. The CDC says there are an average of 11 drownings per day. It's a number one Indianapolis mother is hoping to change after losing her son. WRTV's Adam Schum shows us how she's working to turn her grief into prevention for other parents. Count of three, we're going to say long live junior. Balloons of blue, red, and gray. Fill the indie sky at Thatcher Park on the northwest side. We love you. The colors mark Willie Alexander Jr.'s heroes. Mickey Mouse, Sonic the Hedgehog, and Spider-Man. His favorite characters draped on the outside. You know how you have a child that don't never do anything that won't harm a fly? <laughs> That was my son. Last June, IMPD officers pulled the five-year-old from a pool at Abney Lake Apartments near 38th and Guyon Road. He died at the hospital. Family says he was swimming with friends at the time. Some days, you know, I'm okay. Some days I'm not. Grief definitely comes and goes. One year later, resilience. Do not give up. Some days I know it's hard to even believe or feel like your faith is still there, but you got to believe. The CDC says that for children ages 5 to 14, drowning is the second leading cause of unintentional injury or death. It estimates there are an average of 11 drowning deaths per day. I definitely suggest, um, you know, some sort of flotation device, whether it's um, a life jacket, a puddle jumper, something that's Coast Guard approved. For parents looking to get their children involved in swim lessons, Indy Parks offers lessons for children as young as six months old. Along with the parent, classes focus on exploring the water. Any Park says some lessons start around $30. The YMCA offers similar classes, and for both programs, financial aid is available. Protect your kids by all means necessary. Willie's mom, Sharice, is working to raise awareness so other parents don't feel the same grief. Life jackets, any type of swimming gear, please get it. Please get it because at the end of the day, these are just children and they cannot fend for themselves against no water. In Indianapolis, Adam Schumes, WRTV. Indy Parks officials say they're working to offer free swimming lessons at area pools starting in the next few weeks. If you need a location of an area pool offering swim lessons, you can find a link in this story on our website, WRTV.com.